hungry grizzly bears in the house in the forest. Papa bear, mama bear, baby bear sat down to eat their porridge. Mm, much too hot. Proud Papa bear, let's go and walk in the forest. That's when Goldilocks came by, found the house in the thicket. Knock, 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 no answer so. Goldie entered the kitchen. Mmm, smells good. She grabbed a spoon, though she had no permission. Papa Bear's porridge, way too hot. Mama Bear's porridge, way too cold. Goldie had her fill She felt lazy and tired In the living room she spied Chairs of three different sizes They look quite inviting so Goldie thought she'd try them Papa Bear's chair, way too hard Mama Bear's chair, way too soft As Goldie settled in, that chair broke into pieces. Goldie went upstairs and found three nice beds she could sleep in. They looked quite inviting, so Papa's bed she creeped in. Papa Bear's bed, way too hard. Mama Bear's bed, way too soft. My porridge. Growled Papa. Someone's been eating my porridge. Said Mama. Someone's been eating my porridge. Cried Baby. And they ate it all up. Ate it all up. They walked into the living room and what do you think they noticed? Mm, someone's been sitting in my chair. Growled Papa. Someone's been sitting in my chair. Said Mama. Someone's been sitting in my chair. Cried Baby. And they broke it. In their bedroom now What do you think they noticed? Mm, someone's been sleeping in my bed Growled Papa Someone's been sleeping in my bed Said Mama Someone's been sleeping in my bed Cried Baby And there she is, there she is Goldilocks woke up and saw Three brown bears staring at her She screamed Help! Jumped out of bed Clatter down the stairs and through the door. Gold is gone forevermore. Our three bears, they scratched their heads, fixed the chair, and made the beds and sat down to eat their porridge. And that is the story of the three bears. Through the woods and woke a sleeping lion. Angrily, he grabbed that mouse. She was scared and crying. She said, If you let me go, I'll help you someday. Soon you'll see. When you need me, I'll be there. You'll count on me. The lion and the mouse, the lion and the mouse. This is the story of the Lion said, You tiny thing, what could you do for me? Tell you what, ha <laughs> ha, you made me laugh, so I will set you free. Thank you. Next day, Lion stalked his prey, but on his way back home, he walked into a trap, he was captured and alone. The lion and the mouse, the lion and the mouse. 
Lions roared and scurried to the sea. She gnawed the rope, released the lion, and said, Now we're a team. Lion answered, I was wrong to laugh because you're small. If it weren't for you, I would not be here at all. The lion and the mouse. Hey, kids! <laughs> the ants go ploughing in the field Hi-ho! Hi-ho! The ants go ploughing in the field Hi-ho! Hi-ho! The ants go ploughing in the field To cross a herder's cartwheel And all he does is play While the ants work all day
digging in the sun. Hi ho, hi ho. The ants go digging in the sun. Hi ho, hi ho. The ants go digging in the sun. The grasshopper dances for fun. And all he does is play while the ants work all day. The ants harvest in the fall. Hi ho, hi ho. The ants harvest in the fall. Hi ho, hi ho. The ants harvest in the fall. The grasshopper doesn't help. Him to come in. Hi ho, hi ho. The grasshopper said with a grin. Oh, no. 